Hi guys, welcome to Make It In Minutes Monday. We are coming at you with these two adorable cards. We get the two for one here and uh, they're really very quick. So if you're in a rush and need a couple cards really quick, these are really super simple and you don't need very many supplies. So to get started, we are going to be using this little heart right here from the new Country Bouquet stamp set in the January through April mini catalog of 2023. We're also going to be using the brand new stamp set. Um, we're going to be using the uh, Something Fancy using this sentiment here and the happy birthday that comes uh, that we're going to be posting on the inside. This also does come as a bundle so if you want to order just the stamp set or order the dies that match with it you certainly can do that. If you order these both through our online store you get the 10% discount. Okay to get started see look at this simple supplies you just need your card base right here you need a piece of designer series paper that's measured at four and a quarter by four and a quarter then you're going to need um, two strips of uh, just plain paper uh, or cardstock that is a quarter of an inch by five and a half. So we're going to get this out of the way for now. I'm going to show you how we're going to cut this with our trimmer. I'm going to move this down here. So now you want to make sure if you have a directional paper like this one is here on the back side. However, I'm only going to be using this side. Um, make sure you have it facing the right side up when you cut it. So um, for instance, like this, the hearts are going to be facing the correct direction. But I'm going to be using this side of the paper. And what you're going to do is you're either going to line it up at the one inch mark here and the one inch mark over here. Or what I like is I like using the three quarter inch, inch mark. So I'm going to align the top point to the three inch, three quarters of an inch. And then this other point down here at the bottom at three quarters of an inch. And it doesn't have to be exact, just as long as it's kind of, you know, within the same range. And then you're going to end up with two pieces like this. Okay. So we're going to take our card bases here and we're going to fold them in half. We're going to give them each a good burnish with our bone folder. Just gives it a good crisp edge. All right, like that. Now, what I'm going to use is our green glue. So this one is going to go over here. This one's going to go over on this side. All right. Okay, so there we have those. Now we're going to take these pieces here. Um, you can add glue directly onto the strip, or what you can do is you can just add a thin line of adhesive right here along the edge of both strips. All right, now we're going to take our cardstock and we're just going to lay it right over, making sure that you give enough room so you got a little hanging off the top up here and a little hanging down over there. Next, we're going to come in with our scissors and we're just going to cut the edges off. And to do that really quick, you just flip the card over and give it a good snip like that. Okay, next we're going to bring in our stamps. So we're going to use our two sentiments. We're going to use mint macaron. And then for the inside, we're going to go happy birthday. Next, we're going to come in with our hearts. And we're just going to stamp a couple of those on the front. And then last, we are going to bring in our 22 through 24 in color dots. And we're going to use our sweet sorbet. So what do you think, guys? I hope you really enjoy these two cards. Super quick cards. Very easy. Um, and if you like this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and hit that notification bell so that you'll know when we post new videos. Plus, if you would like weekly card inspiration and five free tutorials, make sure to join our newsletter. You can find the link to join in the description below. Thanks for watching.